boom shakalaka, you know, had you have bought $2,994 of Pepe, the first boys club member to be tokenized on the Ethereum blockchain back in April of last year, one year ago, and then sold just this week, you would have 334 extra money, making you a millionaire. Why did you not do that? But does a better opportunity exist today? Could a mere $120 of Fofar, the last Boys Club member to be tokenized on the Ethereum blockchain, make you a millionaire realistically? Stay tuned. What's up, everyone? Randy here from Crypto Love. Today's video, we're taking a look at could a mere $120 of Fofar make you a millionaire realistically? Before we get into it, guys, like the video, come join us on Twitter at the Crypto Love, and of course, subscribe to the either the coolest or the most mediocre channel on YouTube. This one. Now, as I was saying, back in April 2023, this was the price of Pepe, and then just recently, this past week, this was the price. For you visual people out there who don't just like numbers, had you have bought way back here, okay, when it was nothing, and then sold up there. You would have only needed to buy $2,994 of Pepe. You would have gotten 100 billion Pepe, and then you could have sold this past week, been a millionaire, been driving around in your Lambos with your butlers and all that fun stuff. Why didn't you do that? What is wrong with you? How would you miss such an obvious, obvious play like that one? I mean, at least in retrospect, it seems obvious. Well, today, potentially, Fofar, the last member, Pepe was the first Boys Club member on the Ethereum blockchain. Fofar is the last Boys Club member on the Ethereum blockchain, and we're going to take a look at could $120 of Fofar make you a millionaire realistically? The numbers may just well shock you. Maybe. We'll see. So why Fofar? Why now? Great question. That's why you're so smart and attractive. Now, if we take a look, I'm of the opinion that we haven't even begun to see the beginning of alt season. And as a fact, like the pump that we had a month or two ago was just like a prelude of what's to come. If we take a look at the total altcoin market cap, you can see that after we break through previous support, you can see this band right here. And again, the band right here. After we break through there, there is a first dip before we take off into moon rocket, Lambo, Tesla, SpaceX season, alt season, we'll call it. Happens every time. Well, that's most likely where we are right now. The first dip after breaking through previous support. So that being said, it means that most likely we have quite an alt season to come. As a matter of fact, it could be an alt season to remember based on expanding cycles theory, where instead of being like a four-year cycle, maybe an eight-year or six-year cycle that's just getting bigger. And as the fractal gets bigger, the gains will likely get bigger as well. So it makes you think because last week, GameStop pumped. Now, as GameStop pumped, if we take a look back in 2021, we saw a massive GameStop, pump, GameStop stock pump back here. And then look at what happened to altcoins over the next four months. They went on a massive rally. Now, we have the GameStop pump. Altcoins, as of yet, have done relatively nothing. And just a reminder for where things could go. After GameStop peaked on January 28th, 2021, Solana pulled off a 66x in eight months. Just to show you here the chart, this was where GameStop peaked. And then this was what Solana did in the next eight months. Went on an absolutely massive tear. And right now, meme coins are lining up like they could have a massive run coming up. If we take a look back in 2021, this is Doge and Shiba. Sideways price breakout, consolidation and coiling, breaking above there, and look, second massive meme coin rally. Well, same thing in this cycle with Shiba, Pepe, and Flocky. Sideways consolidation, pump, consolidation and coiling, and look, breaking out from there potentially for a massive meme season two rally. Now, just recently, one of the guys who I follow big time on Twitter, TechDev, 
He says he doesn't much mess with memes, but he's learned not to ignore this accumulation structure regardless of the ticker. Says FOFAR, triangular compression, breakout, expansion. Memes are casino, high risk, high rewards. Structure like these help the odds. Do what you will with that. He takes a look here at Demetra, at Dogecoin, and at FOFAR. Now, all of these have a triangular compression here in green, a breakout in yellow, and then expansion. Now, based on this, it would have a 0 0.005 cent ish FOFAR, or 0 0.005 for FOFAR and the price. And that was last week when he did that, the 14th? Yeah, that was the 14th. And ever since then, guess what? FOFAR has started to break out, started to make some significant gains. So you're asking, what is FOFAR? Well, I've got the answer for you. It's a chubby pig in overalls. The final boys club member to be tokenized on the Ethereum blockchain. You can check out the website fofar.club. Who's Fofar? Fofar is part of Matt Fury's Boys Club comic, famously known for Pepe the Frog. Fofar gave Landwolf explicit details about his personal body art. And stay tuned, this is very, very informative. Hey, Fofar, you got any body art? Oh, I got my wiener pierced back in 01. I've had to flip it upside down every time I peed since. I don't even understand what that means, but maybe somebody with a pierced wiener would understand. And I've had this one since 96. Look at this nice 311 tattoo. Trust your instinct. Let go of regret. How about that? No regrets, right? Anyways, tokenomics, supply 420.69. Of course, the magic numbers for any meme out there. Contract pronounced 0% buy sell tax and liquidity burned. No association with Matt Fury or Content Brett. Just a tribute to memes we love. So all of that fun stuff for Fofar. And you can see on Twitter, you know, nice pictures, fun stuff like that. And they even mentioned a super cool video that had them in it not too long ago. Where is it? Right here. Look at this sexy, attractive man. Gosh, oh, what a looker. I don't know how the girls keep their hands off of him. Well, anyways, so if we take a look at Fofar today, you can see the price is 0.00002. Now, based on this chart that I showed you earlier, this is looking like 0.003 to 0.005, something like that. So as of yet, we are not yet at that price target. And if you take a look, the market cap, $9 million. Now, based on a lot of other coins we take a look at on this channel, that's pretty darn low. So that being said, let's do some math today figure out if $120 of FOFAR could realistically make you a millionaire, realistically. So let's say you watch this video and you, you know, you hear me talking and I said FOFAR many times and you're like, anything that he says, I'm clearly going to buy because he has some magical insight about cryptocurrency that I don't have, which is not true. I'm, you know, just shooting in the <laughs> shooting in the dark like the rest of you but let's say that i did have some type of magic here and you decided to buy a thousand dollars of fofar today or whatever you want but for this example say a thousand dollars now if you did that today you would be able to buy based on this price of 0 0.00002 you'll be able to buy 50 million fofar now here's the interesting thing there's a lot of meme coins to compare this to we can see what other meme coins have done and said hey Maybe Fofar will do the same as these meme coins. Now, one other meme coin we've been talking about on this channel recently, as a matter of fact, it already doubled since we've been talking, actually over doubled since we've been talking about it, almost tripled, is Punk. Now, Punk right now has a market cap of $189 million. And you remember that I said Fofar right now has a market cap of $9 million. To me, not excellent with math, but 9 million is a lot less than 189 million. Well, it turns out that if Fofar just had the same market cap as Punk, you would 21x that thousand dollars, making you $20,925 with a 0 0.0004 Fofar. Wow, right? 21x just to be Punk, which is still like not even doing that excellent yet in terms of cryptocurrencies. Definitely not on the first couple pages of coin market cap. So that being said, what are some other possibilities? Because you remembered, we were talking about Pepe, the first boys club member. We we're talking about Fofar, the last boys club member. Well, what about how about one of those intermediate boys club members, like the middle child that nobody cares about? Well, 
How about Brett? Yeah, that's right. If we take a look at Brett. Brett, another Boys Club member, has a market cap of $728 million. And again, just based on my basic math skills, that's a lot more than $9 million market cap that Fofar has. So if Fofar was to do the same as the middle Boys Club member on Ethereum bo- or on any blockchain, uh, 80x, wow, making you $80,682 from a $1,000 investment. That's pretty darn cool. Now, as we mentioned, and we'll just say this a whole bunch of times because I got a bunch of time to waste to make this video long enough so that you actually watch it. Because if it's too short, you don't watch it. And if it's too long, you don't watch it. You need something in the middle like Goldilocks. So we're trying to make this a Goldilocks video for you. Anyways, if Fofar did the same as Pepe, the last Boys Club member, doing the same as the first Boys Club member, well, guess what? Pepe just recently had a market cap of $4.4 billion. That's a lot more than $9 million. And if Fofar was to do the same, now this is a big if, a very big if. It could be a speculation, may never happen. For all we know, the price of Fofar could go to zero. So, but if this happened, it would be a long shot, but you would 487x your $1,000, making you almost half a million dollars from $1,000 of Fofar with a one cent Fofar. Which brings us to our last scenario because I didn't want to compare this to like Ethereum or Bitcoin or anything because the numbers just got too outrageous at that point. But let's say, you know, the mother of all meme coins or the father of all meme coins or whatever you want to call it, I guess the, the dog of all meme coins, Dogecoin. Well, turns out the Dogecoin had a market cap of $75 billion at its all time high. Now, I'm not going to say that Fofar is going to get that because that would be an exceptional long shot. But what if it did? Because that was last cycle. This is this cycle. Expanding cycles theory. Now we have like children uh, aping into meme coins and who knows? It, and we have not, not only that, we have like uh, hedge funds just degen buying meme coins. So who knows what's possible to happen this cycle? No, if Fofar had the same market cap as Dogecoin, $75 billion. Guess what? You would 8,303x that $1,000, making you $8.3 million from $1,000 of Fofar. As unrealistic as it may be, could possibly happen. And if that did happen, guess what? You could realistically be a millionaire from a mere investment of $120.43 today. So that's all for this video. If you did enjoy it, like the video, come join us on Twitter at The Crypto Love, and of course, subscribe to the coolest or most mediocre or just some channel on YouTube, this one. I will catch you guys later. Have a good one. Love you. Peace. If you don't think Bitcoin's going to a million dollars a coin and then $10 million a coin, you're already a loser. From now on, if you don't own Bitcoin, you're a moron.